How does gasoline get transported? With oil and gas prices always a topic of conversation, especially when they're high, and still ongoing needs to fuel cars, trucks, buses, trains, boats, planes, etc., one element that's not always top of mind but is very important to consider is just how gasoline gets transported. The logistics of oil, gas, petroleum, or any variation of these is a bit different than other products due to their liquid nature and potential environmental impact. So without further ado, here are the ways gasoline and other petroleum products are transported. Ocean Tanker by boat is basically the only way oil and other variations are transported across oceans. Non-powered barges also transport petroleum products shorter distances over water. Pipelines Over land, pipelines transport oil from wells to refineries and storage facilities. Pipelines are additionally used to transport gasoline and other petroleum products in batches. Railroad Rail tank cars are a common method to move petroleum products long distances over land where there are no pipelines, particularly for large-scale overland movement. Trucks Tanker trucks are most commonly used to transport gasoline and other refined fuels to a gas station or other filling station, or even straight to the consumer. They may also carry unrefined petroleum if other means are unavailable. Here's a handy diagram courtesy of the U.S. Energy Information Administration which shows the flow of oil from well, or overseas tanker, to refinery, to storage, and then out to the gas pump for use. Gasoline transportation and the environment. By their nature, petroleum and its derivatives are liquid and, in the case of gasoline, flammable. But the greatest environmental danger they pose is if they are spilled as they can be especially damaging to the natural environment and difficult to clean up. So transporting gasoline, oil, and other forms of petroleum requires care. While petroleum and its variants are generally not thought of as hazardous substances in and of themselves, falling under the term oil according to the EPA, in the case of gasoline, the Federal Motor Carrier Safety Administration does in fact list it as a hazardous material, requiring motor carriers have a minimum of $1 million of financial responsibility coverage to transport it. Have questions about freight and logistics or ready to go managed? Call us at 317-208-5565 or visit our website www.intechfreight-logistics.com and hit the request a quote button to tell us about yourself. We'll be happy to follow up with you to go over your specific business needs and offer up solutions. Please do give us a thumbs up below and subscribe to this channel to get future videos first. Thanks very much for watching.